Hello everybody, it's me, Fat the Ruler, and I'm here for another episode of The Legend of Zelda Twilight Princess HD. And here we go, there's this fish lady, Zora Queen, who, who's dead. She wants us to come with her. And, well, we're gonna go, because we don't really have anything better to do. Welcome back to Twilight Princess HD, which I think I said that already, but never mind. I'm gonna say that again, just so you'll feel even more welcome. Uh, last time, we... Well, first of all, I got really mad, and that wasn't... Not only first, that happened after... It just happened a lot, alright? I was really frustrated and mad. Uh, but also, we we saved a Zora guy, th this lady's son. Uh, we took him... A, just go watch the episode, actually. I'm not, I don't have to explain it. I won't explain it. You have to go back and watch it on your own. That way I get more views and watch time. I'm a genius. Alright, so here we are. And the Zora lady led us right over here to the graveyard. And wouldn't you know that there's a secret passage? I, if you know anything about me, uh, one of the most important things you might want to know about me is that I love secret passages. They're, they're just awesome. Uh, whenever I have like a game where I could build my own, own things, like Minecraft, I always put secret passages everywhere, seriously. I don't know why, but I love secret passages. They're really awesome. And also if I just find them in video games, I get super excited. So, so that's that's really cool. Anyway, here we are. Hello, fish lady. What do you want from me? And uh, there's this weird thing here. Let's see. What is this all about? What do you want from me? All right. Well, hello. I am deeply grateful to you for aiding my son in his time of need. You were right to bring him here. Kakariko Village is a sacred place for the Zora people. It is where we take our eternal rest. My husband in life, King Zora, also rests his spirit here. It is no co coincidence my son found his salvation in this place. Except... Yes, it is! What are you saying? There just happened to be a guy here who could cure him. Or who probably could cure him. I would... How is that not a coincidence? What does this witch shaman guy, Renata, does he just stick around wherever the Zora guys are, guy are buried? What? You're not making much sense here, lady. What are you trying to tell me here? Well, whatever. Apparently it's no coincidence, we'll just believe that. Good. That which I have promised you is within this grave. During his lifetime, my husband created garments specifically for the chosen hero. Garments that house the abilities of the Zora. Yeah, that's pretty great. Give me those now. Yay! Look at that! Those are Zora clothes. Yay, and this look pretty cool, actually. You got Zora armor! This special garment was handed down through the Zora loyal... The royal family. I mean, I'm guessing they were loyal too, but no, it's a royal there. If you have it equipped, you can move freely through the water, but you will be more vulnerable. I can't speak. You will be more vulnerable to fire and ice attacks. I'm sorry, I just woke up. I can't really speak. And now at last I can join the king in his in slumber. And yet, my son, he still knows nothing of my death. If you see him again, please pass on this message. Tell him he must not grieve his mother's passing. Tell him she wanted him to be brave and live on as the king of, the, of our people. And tell him his mother loves him without end. Tell him... Hold on. No, but why couldn't you just stay... That's what I don't understand. There's like... In, in video games, for example, Zelda games, there's always like somebody important dies and then they stick around as a ghost for a little more, more tell you something. And then they just go away. Gone. But why couldn't they just stay here? Alright then. Like, they could just live in the real world and it'd be pretty awesome. They could actually go through things and stuff. Wouldn't that be awesome? And then then the, whoever loves these people, they could still ha be, like, around them. I, I don't get that. I, I don't understand how that makes sense. Well, whatever. Hello, Midna. Well, it's a good thing you found all of your friends and picked up that nifty Zora armor. But aren't you forgetting about something kind of important? The last few cha fused shadow. Like, remember what Farron the Light Spirit said? He said you would need the fused shadows to defeat the Dark Overlord Zant and save the world. So even if you go back now well, with all the people you saved, the whole tragedy would just repeat itself. So let's go get it. We need to go to the temple of the lake on the lake bed of Lake Hylia. Yeah. So I wasn't exactly messing around here, mate. Now I got exactly the thing I needed, didn't I? Because we need this to get to the t temple. Midna, I, I hope you think next time before you get mad at me. Hold on. I want to take a little bit of a closer look at... Well, hold on. No, this thing. This thing right over here. This texture. I don't know why, but it just looks really interesting to me. 
Because you see those little darker curves and all those things? It looks like they're, they're supposed to be kind of like the shadowy places. But since this is just a texture, they're in the same place everywhere you look at it from. And it's kind of weird. <laughs> like, look, you get what I mean? These things. Patrick, if you're not too lazy, stop sitting around there and, well, no, keep on sitting. Just zoom in on there and point, to, point out to people what I mean. Those things. They look pretty... Like, you get what I mean, right? These are supposed to be shadows, but since this is just a texture, of course it doesn't change. Because, like, if they wanted it to, I'm guessing it would just be easier to make... to actually model this bit out. Uh, well, yeah, that's what I wanted to say. That's it for all this area. You know what? I should probably put on the Zora armor. What do you think? Alright. And here we go. We're looking pretty great. You get what I meant when I said this looked pretty cool, all right? Hold on. Actually, you know what? Where's... we do have the iron boots. Let's put those right over here. Oh, right! Guess what we did last time? We wasted a lot of our stuff, for example, arrows, but we got those back. And also, I just used my bottle with the fairy in it on accident. Wait, no, hold on. Wait, we can't... Oh, no! All right, well, we're gonna have to come back here then. Because uh, we don't have the water bombs yet. Oh, how do you... How do you get up... Oh, oh all right, here we go. That's how swimming works. It's... You got a whole day and point down and then you go up. That's great. All right, ow! Hey, stop it. Yeah, but I could just go get the water bombs right now, couldn't I? Yeah, you know what? I'm gonna go do that. Uh, because, conveniently enough, we are right at the place where they sell those. You know, this is the Kakoriko Village graveyard or something. And do you want to know where they sell the bombs? In Kakoriko Village. So we're just gonna run down. Ouch. No, not into the wall. We're gonna run down over here gonna get some bombs and maybe I'll be too lazy to go back but whatever at least we'll have the bombs I think we should have enough money I'm not sure how much they cost I'm guessing more than a regular bombs but yeah I, I think we should be able to afford those so where is Barnes bombs here it is hey what do you got to tell me uh, do you know about the new pro yeah no that's what I'm shut up all right great yeah I'm gonna thanks what do you want what no I don't I don't no 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 thanks all right no shut up all right here we are I said all right a lot there, sorry if that was annoying. Here we go, hello, Mr. Barnes? Do you have anything else uh, to your name? Is there any other bit of your name I should know? All right, I guess not. Hey, I've been waiting on you. Take a peek at this, I finished my water bombs. Yeah, great, they're pretty advanced. Let's take a look, see then. Here we go, oh. All right, how many can we, oh. Next to this, what? Hello? Oh no. Alright, hold on, but I think you could use the water bombs in like, in any normal situation, right? Alright, so I, I guess we'll sell our bombs, that sucks. Come on, this is kind of silly. Alright, I'll sell my stuff. Thanks, I got a ton of rupees. That was totally a good deal. Thanks, I will take my water bombs now. 60 for 10 or, I'll take the big amount. I think I'll buy two of this because... Uh, well, oh, it's, it's full? Alright, I guess we can't carry more than 15. I thought we had... Is that the same with the normal bombs, or do these have different carry amounts? I'm guessing they have different carrying amounts. So where could we go now? So many possibilities! I can't even decide! Alright, I'm gonna go to the Lake Bat Temple. I get... no. Hold on, I really don't wanna go there. I think that might be my least favorite temple from this game. Uh, or maybe that would be city of the city in the sky. I don't know. I really like the forest temple actually and the the fire temple or whatever, you know the The one with the Gorons that wasn't too bad, but oh boy the water temple and the city in the sky oh. uh, if, if you just go Play them. I think that you could easily understand what I don't like about this game I think it's just a bunch of that stuff packed in together if I remember correctly it's just slow and boring and like... Okay, for example, listen to the music right now. Like, not, nothing wrong with it. Might be useful to have a... Wait, hold on, there's a bug. Hello. Uh, but yeah, listen to the music right now. You know? Like, it's just... Also... Kind of... Like, it, it's... It's not like it's ambient or like you're not supposed to pay attention to it. Because Breath of the Wild has music. And, and it's fine, you, you can't, like, of course I would prefer there to be, like, more epic music and all that kind of stuff. But I can understand why they did it. But in this game, the music isn't like, okay, we'll just put the music on the side. No, in this game it's just, the music isn't on the side. It's just, like, really boring. 
and that's like the whole game is so slow and the controls are oftentimes uncomfortable I mean right now no not at all like just the general movement that can work but for example like just so many things are there to just slow you down and that's what I don't like oh hey wouldn't you know that? This is a pretty nice shortcut. Hold on, do we have infinite air, air when we have the Zora thing? I'm pretty sure that's, that's one of the main points of it. The other being, of course, the swimming like this. But, of course, you could just swim normally. So this is not a huge deal. Hello? I'm pretty sure we're heading towards the temple. So hold on, could we just shortcut our way back through here too? Or, or not? I'm, I'm guessing we could. I'm not sure if it would be worth it, because I, I would say once we're done uh, here and we want to go back to Kakariko Village, it would be much faster to just warp there than swim all the way, but who knows? So hello, Zora people down in the temple, what's going on? I am really not looking forward to exploring this whole area later. Uh, look at this! Is this this huge place you have to swim through with this super slow swimming? Oh no. That would not be fun at all. That's not gonna be fun. So how do we get in the temple? Hello, so these are just Zora people. They... I don't think we need to fight against those guys. Wait, what was that? Hello? Oh, it was a... I think they wanted us to talk to that guy. Alright. Well, we need to get in the temple. So let's see. I think if we blow this thing up... Alright, just drop it. Hello? How do you... Alright, well, oh, I guess we need the boots. Thought maybe we could, I could just drop it from the air. Alright, now get a little further away, I think. This... Oh, no, the camera! Come on, the camera almost screwed me over here. I almost swam back, straight back in there. Alright, oh, what does that say? I don't know. And I don't even think it matters. Because if I drop another bomb here... You know what? That is just go straight up there. And that's pretty great for us. Because it blows the entrance up. And by blowing the entrance up, I don't mean it ruins the entrance. No, it opens the entrance. The entrance is... There actually is an entrance now. There wasn't one before. Now there is, and we're gonna enter it. Alright, so I guess in this episode, we're going to start the the water temple. It's not... Like, the episode isn't long enough for me to end it already. So yeah, I guess we'll, we're just heading through here. That's great. With a question mark. Alright. So let's see if this really is as bad as I remember it being. It might not be. Maybe I was just being stupid when I was younger and playing this. But uh, but who knows, really. Alright, what is up with all these guys? Uh, which road should we have taken? There were two ways to go. I'm worried I missed something. Oh, it doesn't look like it, it's a good place to go. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no, I can't even see. Where am I going? Is this the right way? doesn't look like the right way. I'm pretty sure that's where we came from, right? I think so. Yeah, yeah, alright. Yeah, this way. This is the way we need to go. That, I am pretty sure of. The flowers, the... Okay, yeah, no, this is the new... The, the way we need to go. A new direction. Not the one we came from. So that's pretty great. The one we came from didn't have enemies in it. Hello, water temple. What's going on in here? It's a... Okay, lake bat temple. Whatever, it's just the water temple. I'm gonna, probably gonna keep calling it that. Because that's what this essentially is, they just didn't want to call it the water temple again. If you get what I mean, does that make sense? Hey, Link, no! Why did you go in the water? Oh, no. Alright, well, hello. Get over here. Get over here, you choo-choo guy. Oh, wait. Uh, I guess since our bottle is empty, we could scoop this. Pretty sure this, like, regenerates their health and stuff. You can put red chew jelly. Alright, eight hearts. Whoa. That is really handy, actually. Alright, nice. I am pretty happy we got that. And hello, we got more water bombs, that's right. I shouldn't have bought all those from Barnes. Wasted some rupees there. Could have just bought five, made my way over here, and then we would have been fine. You know? Alright, what is this? Don't tell me it's more water bombs. Oh, it's arrows, okay, great. I was afraid these were all gonna, all these chests were just gonna be water bombs, so I'd just be wasting potential water bomb supply things here. Since my back was full, that would not have been fun at all. But conveniently enough, didn't waste a lot. Just a few. Like, I'm guessing, how many had we spent before? Uh, 10 minus that amount. That's how many we wasted. Alright, hey, get out of here, you guys. Alright, so this purple jelly, I think this is kind of this random mystery potion thing. Oh! Well, hello.
low. So if you if you drink if you drank the purple stuff, it could give you a good effect, it could give you a bad effect. So I'm not even gonna bother risking with it. Okay, so this is the temple with all those kinds of switches. And these are not the fun kinds of switches. No, these are not the Nintendo Switch kind. Uh, these are the kinds that kind of turn all the mechanisms in the temple and then you block off routes and you open off new routes and this doesn't really sound terrible, is it? The idea isn't terrible, but something I remember being not that fun. Okay. Well, hello. Ooh, do I want to shoot those mid now? Uh, is that what you're gonna tell me? Well, that's treasures. Yeah. Oh, great. Thanks. Thanks for, for telling me the thing I already figured out. Good job, Midna. You've been so helpful. Alright, hold on. Here we go. Let's do our bow and arrow combo. And I can't really see with all this fire in my face, but it should be good. Alright, shoot that over there. Maybe we could... We, could, we, could we just have done it with normal bombs? Not sure. I hope I'm not wasting anything. Okay. Well, I think we got it. Looks like we go. Whoa! What is this? I can't. Hey! Oh no! Ah! I didn't. What is this? This is ridiculous. Where are we going? Oh, so this is a nice little bridge thing here. Oh, hey, it's this guy. Wait, hold on. Can we even? You you would usually use the hook shot to get this guy. Or at least that's what I've done. All right. Hello. No. Just come here. Time to dodge you. All right. Oh yeah. Right. We actually don't even have the like jump dodge move or whatever it's called. Alright then, hello. No! Hey, get him! Hey, whoa, why aren't you getting him? No, get him! No, that's. Oh, of course they required two hits. Wait, ow! Hey, no, no, stop it. I got a shield, are you being stupid here? Hey, no, just stay like that. And I got you! No, 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 I said I got you! No, that's not how you get it. How I get you? No, alright, here you go, die! Okay, whew. We got him! That was not too easy. I mean, it wasn't hard either, it just didn't take uh, really quick, it wasn't really quick. Alright, let's defeat all these guys, whose names I still don't know. I might have, hold on, actually no, I think they're Tektites, aren't they? I'm pretty sure I, like, I wasn't sure what to call them in one episode and then I googled it and put their name on the screen. Right, didn't I, didn't I do that? Pretty sure I wanted to do that. So yeah, I think these are Tektites. So that is nice to know. I, no, I still don't know what these pick, pick guys are, whoever they are. You know, the guys with these things. Well, well I want you to pick it up. Pick it up! Alright. Yeah, these guys. Don't know what they're called. So maybe, Patrick, if you don't mind, could you check that out for me as well? Patrick editing that guy. You know what I'm talking about. The guy Patrick who's editing. Not the Patrick who's playing right now. Even though there's not a huge difference. The only difference is that I'm playing here right now. And the other Patrick is editing the footage of me playing. So take that, Patrick. You get the worst end of the deal. You gotta edit the videos, all right? And I'm just kidding, it's the same Patrick, it's still me. It's just I'm doing different things at different points in time. And that kind of makes us different people. Uh, why am I even talking about that? I should maybe be talking about the game. All right, so let's see. Oh, these are just pots. Well, it's... Oh, wait, no, no, it isn't. There's a chest as well. Well, what does the chest do? Come on. What have you got for me? Oh, some water bombs. Ten again. Great. Couldn't you, like, have two chests that each have five? That would be better for me, thanks. Because otherwise I'm wasting water bombs here. And that is just not fun. At all. Uh, because... Well, you see... It's not. Alright, well, let's go through the door. Let's see, hold on. What are we gonna... Wait, aren't we gonna unlock the hookshot in this temple? Or it's called the claw shot here? Yes, we are, aren't we? <laughs> well, let's go do that then, somehow. Why does this game just look so dull? Like, I just can't do it. Look at this picture. It's supposed to look all epic and cool, but it just doesn't. It doesn't look the usual awesomeness that Zelda games usually do. This, this is just kind of like what is, if a Zelda game tried to be this super realistic thing, like I don't know what the other games are. I don't, I don't know, basically, uh, but completely failed at it because that is not the point of Zelda. All right. 
So like just just everything about this game. Well, right now talking about like the way it looks, just the colors and everything. It's just so kind of tiring and boring. That, that and that's just another thing. Like there are just so many little tiny bits of this game that contribute to making me just feel overwhelmingly tired and bored. All right, and it's not like I don't like this game at all. No, I do. Uh, because if I didn't like it at all. Uh, then I probably wouldn't be playing it. The only way I'd play a game I don't like is like just for the sake of making fun of it. So yeah, like no, I, I, I definitely also do enjoy moments of this game and it's definitely not a terrible game. But there are just so many little things that keep making me be like, oh my goodness. And they just keep on piling on. And that's what I don't like. Alright, wait, we can't grab onto that? I mean, I don't know if I want to even right now, but... Okay, yeah, oh, we need to grab onto those from the bottom? Right, I think so. So what are we doing exactly? Here we are, at the rotating bit section. And it's no fun at all, if my memory is to be believed. I am pretty sure this was no fun at all. So feel free to correct me, because I'm not saying that I know wall here. Alright, come on. I'm gonna take care of this guy. Alright. What is this? It's a chest. Hey! I like chests. Chests are pretty great if they have good things inside them. Hey, we got more arrows. We've collected 60 arrows here and we've shot like... 3 or 5 or 6. What, you know, those bomb things. Uh, those stalactites. That's what we blew up. That's it. So great. We're also wasting arrows here. Hey! Get in the door. You stupid. Alright, look at this little thing under the door, like these little bars, uh, that is there for a reason, it's just not, it not, it's not just a decoration-y thing, uh, we're actually gonna have water flowing through all these things, and I'm pretty sure that's the main point of this temple, you just go around collecting water and stuff and it's gonna be flowing, and you don't go through here, do you? Uh, no you don't, I'm pretty sure you have to go up the stairs and through some, through some doors up there. And that's how you do things. So I guess uh, something we should do straight away, the main thing we are supposed to do, and the, the, almost the only thing we can do right now, is to grab onto this. But how would we do that? You can't jump. And things not jumping off of this automatically. So how would we, we even go about doing that? Hello? Can you jump? No. No, you can't. No, you can't. Okay. I'm a little bit confused. Well, let's check out over here. Oh, well, right then. Hey, oh no, wait, that's a bit of a problem. Ah, wait, that's also, oh, I don't even have the iron boots equipped. Well, that's a bit of a problem again. Oh no, I am not a huge fan of this. Hit them, Link. What do you mean you can't swing your sword just because you're swimming around? That's crazy. All right, well, let's look around down here. It looks like in addition to all the stairway rotating stuff, uh, all those shenanigans, this temple also, just as the Ocarina of Time Water Temple, has changing water levels. The thing we all freaking love, right? Am I right? We all just can't wait to have more of that. Alright, well I'm just checking around the water here. Just to see if there could be any doors here. There's nothing. There's nothing. Why is the. What is this thing even here then? Am I missing something? I don't know about you, but I would assume this whole thing would be here. So you could collect some sort of thing down there. You could go there, like maybe a secret tunnel. You could blow up a wall. And you could go through it, and that's the point of this section, but no! Are you kidding me? It's just empty, completely empty. You know, I'm not buying that. I don't believe that there's nothing at all to this. No, there'd have to be. Something, some tiny bit. Uh, something has to be going on over here. I'm just not sure what. Or maybe there isn't anything. Maybe this really is just a pointless thing. In which case, well, that's not very good. Now, is it? Hold on. What I haven't... Oh. Aha. So, this is what we should do. Hold on. No, but I had another idea. Alright. That's a stupid idea, actually. 
Never mind about that. Was not a good idea, was it? Hold on, was it? I could check. Is it a good idea? Uh, no, no, it isn't. All right, well, let's go back. Let's get back to my probably actually a good idea. Except it's not really a crazy good idea. It's just a thing you can do here. Yay! Let's rotate the staircase. All right, I, I'm pretty sure when you grab... Yeah, all right, here we go. So, ow! I hit it when I hit my head. It's not fun at all. Oh, wow, the staircase looks weird. All right, so what's going on? Hello. Here we are, upstairs. Do we enter this door? Or do we enter another door? Uh, there are infinite possibilities, except maybe not. Maybe we can just go through this door. I feel like it... Oh, n no, is this... Oh, not him again, or her. Whatever. Hello. What's up with you? Phew, free at last. Gracious, you're that for nice fellow who helped me out the other day. How nice to see you again, Bill. Now that we found each other again, let's stick together a bit, hmm? I'll be right with you, so if you want to warp out, just let me know. Oh, great. I have this thing. Woo. I have this thing on my item screen. This and that just awesome. All right, so there's this door. Let's see, there is this door. There might be another door. There is another door. Yeah, see? See what I told you? Countless possibilities. Because two doors are totally countless possibilities. Don't argue with me. Okay, so I suppose... Uh, I guess we'll go through this first. Can we? Can we go through here? Oh, yes, we can. Alright, well, that's great. Anything to do up here? How do we get through? Hello? Am I missing something? Is there a secret down in the water? Actually, did I get tricked? I don't really know. Like these, it looks like to open these, you would need some sort of water flowing through because, you know, there are these spinning blade things. How, like, I would say these require, hold on, let me just jump here. I would say these require water to get moving. Or do you disagree? All right, let me just check down here. Have we been through here? Because there were bits we didn't get to. Ah, here we go. Here's a chest. What's in this chest? Is there something worth getting? I doubt it's the hook shot because items you usually get after boss fights. Oh, the dungeon map. All right, well that's nice too. Thanks, yellow arrow, all that good stuff. Uh, we don't have the compass yet, do we? Uh, yeah, no, we don't. So. Yeah, won't be the map mode won't be of too much use because well we can't we can't really tell any items locations we don't have that oh well hello would you look at that all right I need to remember we haven't gone through any of the doors upstairs yet hmm, but I wonder what's up with this section oh no all right it opened up a bunch of the rest of the temple. That's pretty great. That's what we're gonna call it. A bunch of the rest of the temple. Patrick, check if it fits in the video title. If it fits in the video title, that's gonna be the video title. A bunch of the rest of the temple. That's probably gonna be the video title. Actually, no, don't do that, Patrick. Or maybe maybe do that. I don't know. Decide for yourself. That's just a, a suggestion. You could make that the video title. I think it's an okay thing. Because I fell down. Wasn't expecting that. Oh my goodness! I, I don't know why, I'm just really... <clears throat> like, really not looking forward to the rest of this temple at all. Like, I I'm not a huge fan of temples usually in Zelda games. But, like... What is it with this game? It just keeps making me not... Not have fun. Because seriously, the Ocarina of Time Water Temple is kind of notoriously hated and bad. You know, notoriously hated by people and just bad but I like I didn't mind it that much it's, it's not an amazing experience but like you just you still have fun it's still kind of a cool thing to get through the temple and you're not like you, like do you get what I mean maybe you don't maybe I'm not making any sense at all here but what all, what I'm saying here is just that hello no nothing's happening all right well what do we do then what if I go on this side? Is there anything up with that? Oh, yes, there is. Or maybe, maybe not. Oh, yes, there is. It looks like there is. Can we climb in here? Oh, hey, no, get out of here. 
I said, oh, come on, that was just not cool at all. What? So, like, I, like, I, I, if you compare it, like, any of this game's temples to the Ocarina of Time temple, uh, like, even the water temple, I would say, pick the water temple. The water temple is better. So, yeah. Like, I don't really understand. I can't tell you what this game is doing so differently. But it, it, there is something. Not sure what, but there is something. Alright, well, hold on. Could we blow this up? Alright, hold on. How do we put the combo off? Here we go. Alright. Let's put the bomb here. Because it looks like it could maybe blow it up. Alright, then just stand on... Well, I guess not. The bomb didn't work and standing on this didn't work. <clears throat> well, that's great. That is just... Hey. No. Come on. I was gonna... I was just putting on my iron boots. Alright, then. Well, this time, we're gonna get right in there with those. Hey. Well, that is just awesome. Maybe we're not supposed to get on this. I don't know. It looks like these things are supposed to blast you. No. No, that didn't do anything. All right. That is cool. We're going to just climb up this. Let's see. Maybe there is anything. Something. Just anything at all to do up here. Let's see. Which way should we go? I'm guessing to the left. I doubt there's much to do to the right. We already were over there. Kind of. Didn't look like there was much to do. All right. Wait, how would I? Hello? Do I just jump on it? Uh, no, uh, obviously not. Apparently not. So what do we do? Alright, maybe I should look to the roof or just towards the ceiling and just look up. Maybe there's more things to shoot at. Aha! What did I say? There, oh, whoa, what was that, Link? <laughs> Link, what was that? Hold on, I gotta do that again. Alright then. Yay! Look at this! The Link dance! Everybody do the Link dance! Yay! <laughs> Patrick, put some music here. Yeah! Alright. Link, get 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 back up here. Get back up here and do not... No more Link dance, okay? It was fun while it lasted, but we don't need any more. Where's the bow? Here's the bow. What? What's going on? No. What am I doing? Alright. Take the... There, here we go. Here we go. I got the combo. Alright, shoot that. Yay! Alright, let's see what, what's up with the chest. Oh, no. Oh, no, Link. No, Link, don't do... Don't do things that are not fun. Okay? Just don't... Don't do any things that are not fun. Just... If, they, if there are things that are not fun, just say no. I won't do it. Unless saying no is not fun. In which case, hey, we've got kind of a problem here, haven't we? Alright, well, jump over here. Jump! Oh, that was close. Whoa, okay, whew, that was a little freaky, alright, so what's, this, this, this bridge here, I would say we need to get this up somehow, and maybe, thing up there with those platforms, I would say we would want to get that spinning, wouldn't you, I think that's what we might want to do here, uh, let's just look around, and see if there's any way we could accomplish that. I can't really say I am seeing a way like that, but who knows, there might be a way. Alright, oh no, hit that, hit that, come on, Link, there we go. Well, the only thing I could say we can do is just look around for more of those to shoot down, but there aren't any more of those water shooty up things, and that's of course the <laughs> perfectly accurate name for those, but there aren't many more of those. And these are like the only point of even shooting those things up there. They're only up above. Well, hold on, this is a. What is this link? Climb up the stupid thing! Oh my goodness. Uh, but yeah, Link, you're kind of interrupting me here. You're trying to make me mad again, and well, you're succeeding. But my point is, how are there? How are these things only and just precisely above these water things? Isn't that? Just a little too much of a coincidence. Uh, how would we get this spinning? Oh, no, I would say, yeah, oh, then no, we need water. That's all we need here. We need water to somehow be coming from a somewhere around here. Uh, hold on, so this was downstairs, right? Yeah, we would need to go upstairs if we could, if we can enter that. Which, yeah, I think there's only one place left that we haven't checked right now. 
that we could actually do anything in potentially and it is the door on the other side of this isn't it I might be mistaken here but I think that is our first thing to head to oh do we have a small key oh yes we do where did we get that from I have no idea well whatever we have it and that's really all that matters well no not really but it, it mattered it mattered quite a bit so don't you even dare go scoffing at my small key. The small key is very important. It's a very important uh, thing to be to completing dungeons. So don't you even dare disparage the small key. What am I saying? Does this make any sense? Probably not. All right, let's get rid of all these guys. Or maybe that's just that one guy. That could also work, but no, there's other guys too. All right, your water bombs. Why do we need water bombs? <laughs> I mean, like, don't worry. I mean, what? That, that didn't make any sense. Like, I, I, I get it. Water bombs are great. Don't worry. I haven't forgotten about that. But I doesn't look like. Oh, well, no, they are gonna be useful. All right. Just as I was about to say, or just as I was saying, it doesn't look like they'd be useful in getting me across here. Uh, well, no, they actually were. Uh, I didn't need the ones we got, but they certainly didn't make anything worse either. So let's get up here, and I guess this little thing here, whatever you call those, is going to help us open the door. It's just going to open the door, it's not going to help us open the door. It just opens the door, okay? You don't need to add pointless words all over the place, Patrick. It's all good, it still worked. Hmm. What about this thing, though? Alright, you know what? I'm just, I'm getting annoyed. I'm not gonna... Go, I don't want to go back to the menu every time to switch on or off the freaking bomb arrows. Why well, couldn't they just have those as, special, as different items? Like, I, I don't get me wrong, I do like that they work this way, but sometimes it gets annoying to just switch back and forth all the time. It just happens occasionally. Okay, which way should I go? Because, well, there's this thing in the middle here, and then there's wherever this door leads over here. Well, let's see. I guess I'll check this door. It looks like this was a secret thing. <clears throat> so, there might be a cool little bonus thing. Oh, hello. What on earth are you? Oh, whoa. Oh, no. Oh, no. Hello. All right, what, what can we do to you? All right, no. Well, that's not it. Uh, can we just shoot you with a normal bow? Uh, doesn't look like it. All right, bomb arrows. Uh, that's what we're going to do. All right, no. This... The, here we go. Alright, then. Did that do anything? Oh! Hey! Yes, it did. Yes, it did. Alright, bomb arrows. Bomb arrows. That's what this whole thing is about. This whole temple. Oh, well, that was easy. Thanks for the arrows. So good. They replenish all my stuff. Uh, th that, that's nice. They give me more than I even need. And that is definitely not a bad thing. But we can't get through here, can we now? We can't do anything here. That sucks. Well, we could go through here, I guess. Maybe this will be useful in some way. Hello? What is this? Oh, no. This is purple guys. They're not even useful. All right, well, here's the red guy, but he's not useful because we don't have any bottles. Uh, so that is not very fun. What is this place? Hey, look at that. There's a chest, and also there's a keys. Oh, no. Oh, no. I don't like you guys. The keys, you're not, you're not fun. Oh, thanks for the heart, though. That, that was really helpful. I like that you give me a heart. I like when people give me hearts. It's nice. All right. Oh, this will open a locked door, you say, huh? What's up with this middle place? I, I, I feel like, like I don't want to go there because I feel like maybe I'd miss something over here when I if I went there. But then again, I, I don't... I, I'm not sure which way is the optional secret thing and which way is the bonus I mean which way is the actual way to go maybe we need to go to both places whatever I'm just gonna go right through here what is this oh hello what do you want here Lysel foe get off oh is he dead oh well, that was easy how do we get this spinning okay I'm guessing we need to go to the to the other room actually the one over there the one that needed the small key I am pretty sure that is the best thing we could do. Yeah, okay, so we're gonna go there. I think we're gonna get the water flowing. At least that's my assumption. And then we, we come back here. And 
the water is flowing and then probably a thing is gonna be spinning in the middle room there. So let's open this bit up. Pretty sure we have everything we need for this. I don't think we could have gone anywhere else. Oh no, wait, that was not the plan. That was a stupid, if it was a plan, Ling, that was a stupid plan. And if what if it wasn't the plan, then oops, you just messed up. Totally wasn't me who, who messed up, it was Link, okay? Don't get mad at me. Uh, what's going on over here? Uh, how do we get back on the other side? I guess we don't. Yeah, I suppose we don't. Wait, hold on, what's up with this? Alright, there are these hookshot targets. I remember... Uh, like, there's gonna be water flowing down the spiral. I remember eventually, at some point, uh, going up this thing with the hookshot and our iron boots and just it being really tedious. Let's see. Oh yeah, I think... Yeah, so right now we don't have the hookshot, but we need to get the water flowing. So eventually you get the hookshot, and then you make your way up this with the hookshot, because there's this, this water and it's real slow. And then you get up here because you need to use the hookshot for like a chest, something like that. Let's see, can we even see the chest? Uh, I think it's probably... Yeah, you see that one? So that's a whole great deal here. You gotta come back here. I wish, I wish we could just set like a warp point here, that would be cool. Alright, let's get here. Here we are. And I guess let's flick the switch. Let's see, yeah, let's go do that. Yay, we open the water gate thingy, whatever this is. Alright, hold on. Do not let yourself get taken away by this. Okay, yeah, th here it isn't strong enough to really flow me down anything. Alright, something I want to try. I want to try walking on this, no, uh, on these edges there. Come on, get on over there. Like you see, this is what I don't like sometimes about video games. Like there are things which are like, oh hey, if this were real life, I could totally just grab onto, the oh no, onto this and climb all the way, climb all the way over there. And I wouldn't need some special item, but no, it's a video game. So you gotta have these crazy shenanigans or whatever. Not sure what to call this stuff, but you get what I mean. You, you gotta use your crazy items, you can't do that, yet you can't grab onto that stuff and climb. It's not like Link should be pretty skilled and pretty, I don't know, should just able to climb after all this stuff has been through. He should be capable of doing that. But no, 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 you, you can't do that. You can only walk around and roll into things and hit your head. Alright, but yeah, I'm not complaining about that really, I'm just saying, pointing out it doesn't make sense, but it's not really something that bothers me too much, it just sometimes looks weird in the video games. Hmm. So what are we doing now? I guess we got everything done here we could do right now. So let's head back, through this door, and then through the other door. That's how, how things go. You gotta go through doors. That's what we do here today. That's the point of the episode. We're gonna be entering doors. I guess let's enter this door then. There we go. Is there gonna be a boss fight? Like a mini boss? I hope not. We killed a Lysel I wonder if he's still alive down there. Even if it was even if he survived the fall earlier, I would say he would have respawned anyway by now. But I guess he didn't. So the game just counted him as defeated. That's the way I see it. I might see it completely wrongly, completely completely stupid here. But, maybe, maybe, just maybe, I am correct. So, how do we get down here? Like, which way do I actually want to jump? Oh no. Okay, well this didn't go terribly. Imagine if I fell down somewhere where I couldn't get out of I could have gotten stuck here. Do you even think about those kinds of risk li risks, Link? I doubt you do. You probably don't. It's quite crazy. So... Now we can head over there, but you know what? You can't see that. I'm ending the episode, so thanks for watching, everybody. I hope you enjoyed watching me do a bunch of stuff in the water temple and some stuff before the water temple. I'll see you guys next time. Peace out.